All right, guys, good morning. Good morning. It is really cold. Está bien, bien frío. Buenos días. Y estaba como 20 grados esta mañana, like 20 degrees. This morning, there is no wind. Look at the flag. It's just sitting there still. La, la, la bandera está, está paradita. No está haciendo frío. Uh, no, perdóneme, no está haciendo nada de viento. Anyways. Uh, all right, so <clears throat> let's see what we're working on. Uh, it's uh, today what I'm going to be working on is the exhaust. So, eh, con el con la pipa, el bajante, el exhaust, el header, it is it is thirty right now inside thirty degrees. Mm. Yeah, thirty degrees, thirty grados. Okay, ayer ayer se le Se le tiró este bed liner, uh, a roof rack, y al techo. So, so we did bed liner yesterday, and it looks, it looks amazing, amazing. It looks good. So today, uh, today we're gonna work on this. Vamos a trabajar en con esto. Es más, deme deme un break. By the way, we also worked on bumpers. We got some uh, some body filler on both of them. Eh, le metimos un poco de, de, de bando. Y ya le metimos epoxy primer. So we uh, body filled it and epoxy prime the, the, the bumpers. So that is uh, one of the major things. Now, uh, this is what we're gonna be working on today. Or half of the day, hopefully. Okay. Let me set you up here and I'm gonna show you what's going on. Let me get the skirt up. Alright. So exhaust. This exhaust, I purchased it. I compré este y lo compré y estaba económico. I purchased this and it was really cheap. Uh, probably um, about a hundred dollars, a hundred and seventeen. It's como ciento ciento quince dólares por esto. Pero el problema es que suena feo. So the problem about this uh, setup is that it sounds horrible. It sounds like <coughs> like it's missing, like plop 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 plop. So I really don't like it. No me gusta como suena. So lo que voy a hacer es y esto lo que hice. Este voy a usar el header. I'm gonna use the header because this is really good. I, I like the header. Uh, it's tucked in. It, it doesn't interfere. Está bueno. Y le voy a enseñar. All right. So. This is what I got. I got some leftover piping from my uh, beetle. I got two. I don't know which one to use yet. And I went and got me a, a V-band clamp, just like that. And also I went and got me a straight through uh, muffler. So this is gonna go right, right there. And it's gonna look amazing. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna cut this right here. Lo voy a cortar aquí. Y entonces, este, lo voy a cortarlo aquí. Y le voy a poner un V-band. I'm gonna put in a V-band here, right? And then I'm gonna weld the other side here, of course. And we're gonna have this muffler. And it's gonna look good and it's gonna sound good. So that's what we're gonna do today. Uh, probably it's gonna take me half a day, maybe a couple hours. Quizás me toma como dos o tres horas. So let's get to it. Vamos a hacerlo. Vamos a coger y cortar. Cortamos. 
Y entonces vamos a soldar, vamos a cortar aquí. We're going to cut here. And then we're going to use this as a tab. We're going to put a tab. Vamos a poner un tab aquí para, para darle support a esto de aquí a aquí. So I think it's going gonna, it's gonna to sound look, and, and, and it look, it's going to look good. Creo que va a sonar bien y, y se va a ver bien. So vamos. Let's go. Let's All go. right, folks. So I think, I think I'm going to go with this, uh, this end to make it straight out. And... Uh, and it's gonna look good. I think I think I'm gonna point it just like that one is pointing this way. But it's gonna be pointing it's gonna be pointing out probably downward just here. I don't know. No don't know yet. But anyways, um the bumper fits really good. El, bu el bumper está el, la defensa está funcionando. Este, después que la arreglamos y, y, y la detallamos, se ve muy, 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 muy bien. Uh, lo que hay que tirarle es un poquito de, 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 de high build primer, darle un poco de lija y pintar. Ok, so tengo que hacer esto. I have to do this in order to put the deck lid, uh, the, the engine lid and then the apron. So con esto. Cuando termine esto, entonces puedo poner lo que le falta, que es este, esto, la, 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 la tapa del motor y el, el apron de abajo. Yeah, yeah. Pero el bumper quedó bien, ya tengo la medida. I got the measurement already from here to here. It could be no higher than 10 inches from the top. So, 10 pulgadas. Tiene que quedar, pero está, se ve muy bien y se va a ver muy bien. Este, uh, we'll see. Uh, no sé si, si también pueda hacerlo un, esto un poquito más largo. Que salga el tubo aquí, así. Maybe, maybe so. What do you think? We'll see. Porque okay, ahora mismo va a salir aquí. ¿No ven? Ahí. So, se va a quedar escondido. Y si lo pongo un poquito hacia abajo. Uh, sí. Veremos. Vamos a ver. Ok. Alright, so this is how it's gonna look right there. You see it? Let me get this lower. So así que se va a ver. Entonces eh, cogimos medida. So what I did was I ensure that the bus is level and it is it is level right there. You see it? It's level. And then that this is level. And it's level. So that is going to come out. Eso, eso va a venir. Me, me aseguré que la, que la combi estaba derechita. Y entonces que esto esté derecho. Ahora lo, vamos, lo que vamos a hacer es. Vamos a taquear esto. A puntearlo. Porque ahí es que va a ir. That's where it's going to go. And then we'll worry about the other stuff later. Okay. So después no. no este, hacemos lo demás después. Pero esto es lo más importante. Que, que la salida del header salga este salga derecha so that 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 is it and then this is why this sounds like crap there you go i don't know if you can see i'm gonna show you it's got <coughs> it's got like a like a silencer well, let me show you outside the more light the better okay the sun is uh, warming up okay so it's got there you go It's got a, anyways, this, this right here is restricted. Está restringido. Y por eso, <coughs> por eso es que está, que suena bien feo. Suena bla, 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 bla. So, okay, ahora vamos a, eso no sirve. Ahora vamos a soldar esto. So let's go ahead and get this, uh, let's get this tapped.
Oh, there we go, folks. That's how it's going to look. And it's looking really, really good. Um, <clears throat> it's level. And uh, this is how the uh, collector looks. So I just need to weld this back and then clean it. So tengo que soldar esto y después limpiarlo. Este, y ahora, ahora todo lo que tenemos que hacer es, vamos a ponerle dos tags, una aquí y una abajo. Otra de tags, one, two, three. And then, we're going to figure, después de eso, después que taqueamos eso, uh, we're going to figure which of the two we use, cuál de las dos vamos a usar, y creo que voy a usar la larga. Y entonces la ponemos en la, en la parte de, de atrás. Y no importa. No importa porque eh, puede jotarla. You can, you can rotate it after. So it doesn't matter. You can, you can uh, put it on there and then just go up and down, up and down. However you want it to go. So no issues there. Um, all right. So let's go ahead and get attacked. All right, folks, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut 70 millimeters out of here. So 70 is about three inches. I got to cut. Tengo que cortar como tres pulgadas y ya estamos. Estamos ready. It looks good. Se ve muy bien. Y entonces ahora vamos a, vamos a soldar este, este stainless. Okay, so it's uh, it looks okay. It's uh, it's welded. So I just changed my tip. Yo cambié la la tip a una cinco con un con un electro este con un tungsten pequeñito y le bajé el fuego. And uh, it's working really really good now. It's not fourteen gauge. It's about eighteen gauge. Dieciocho. Creo que esto es dieciocho. I think we got to measure that. Let's see. Vamos a ver. So it's, uh, it's about 18. Yeah, it's about 18. 18. <coughs> 18. So right there. All right. So now we're gonna do the uh, the uh, the exhaust side, and it's it's measuring. It's it looks really good. So now we're gonna clamp it in place and try to see if we if it welds. So let's do it. All right, folks. I got it tacked, and that's how it's gonna look. It's gonna come and then come out, dump out. So it looks good. I like it. Now we're gonna go ahead and get it get it welded. Vamos a a ahí ya está taquia y ahora vamos a a soldarla, okay? Um. Okay, so here it is. It's uh, welded, TIG welded, stainless. It's not the prettiest, but it's welded. Uh, let me get it here to the light. Vamos a que la vean. Está bastante, está bien soldada. All right. So ahora la vamos a montar. We're gonna, we're gonna get, it, get it mounted so we can see it. Uh, I still gotta weld the other side. 
So, but it looks okay, good. Okay, folks, so just, just completed the welding around the, uh, around the, the collector. So now it's a collector. Uh, so ya terminé el, la soldadura alrededor de, del colector y todo quedó bien. Este, me dio un poquito de problema o trabajo en la parte de atrás, pero ahora lo vamos a limpiar. So now I had a little issue in the back. Of course, it's the back. And then, uh, but now we're going to clean it and, and then we're going to mount it. And I'm going to show you. So la, la voy a limpiar, la voy a montar y le voy a enseñar. Está, que, quedó, quedó bastante bien. No la he montado. So vamos a ver. All right, guys, so here we go. I don't have time. Oh, I don't have money. I'm sorry. I don't have money for a vintage speed, but I have time to use my knowledge and my creativity. So, no tengo, no tengo el dinero a comprarme una, 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 una nueva de vintage speed, pero pues tengo la imaginación y la creatividad para hacer algo de nada. Y esto costó 20 dólares, 20 dólares on the clamp. It comes with the ends. And there was two of them because I need one for the other. Uh, uh, and then uh, I think it was 27 dollars for the uh, muffler. And I already had the, uh, the pipe. So, you know, 50 bucks plus my time. And we, <clears throat> we got this out. And... I just got to put a little bolt here, and that's it. Tengo que poner un, tor un tornillo aquí para sujetarla, pero ya con eso estamos. Quedó, quedó muy bonita. No sé, no sé si, si ponerla. I'm not sure if leave it down or out, straight out. I think down a little bit it would be nice. Yo creo que para abajo, así un poquito se ve bien. Creo que sí. Está derecha. It's straight. It looks good. Man. I'm amazed. I'm very, very amazed. I'm, I'm very happy that I can do this. Yo estoy bien alegre que puedo hacer esto. Este. Y pues, y como digo, yo no lo hago para para ganarme dinero, para, para nada. Yo lo que lo hago es para, pues, por hacerlo y por ustedes. Y esto tiene que sonar mejor. And this has got to sound a lot better uh, with this. So, and I'm going to start it here in a little bit and, and, and see. All right, so let's get to it. All right, guys, so I can't can't have this running too too long because it's the uh, garage is closed. Está está el garaje cerrado. Pero mira qué lindo suena. Chupa ya. Wow. Suena muy bonito. Está frío. It's cold. So very cold. So yeah, and the uh, the engine is cold. But anyways. It sounds really, really good. It's got a lot of compression. And this is how an 1835 needs to sound. Así es que un 1835 tiene que sonar. Qué lindo suena. Escuchen. Wow. Wow. Sounds amazing. Let me turn it off. Oh wow. Wow, that sounds amazing guys. Suena tremendo, tremendo. Nítido. Muy un sonido bien, bien bonito. It's got a really, really nice tone to it. It sounds really, really rich, really good, really 
Well, not rich as in, you know, rich as in it's got, you know, good vibes. Man. Uh, that's pretty cool. All right. Just, uh, you know, this conclude this video. Aquí se termina este video. Este, no sé si les ha gustado. Espero que les haya, que les haya gustado el video. Está tirando aceite. Este, my jack is going bad. So, I hope you like the video. And, and we'll see if we can do something other. Something else like that. I mean, I, I really like doing stuff like that. A mí me gusta de verdad hacer eso. Y, man, qué bonito quedó. Qué bonito quedó, man. And I like it. I really like it, man. Alrighty. So, so I'll let you go. And I hope you liked the video. Um, and don't forget to, uh, to follow me. You know, share, like, and subscribe. And like I said, I, I don't do this for any money or any, any fame or nothing. I just do it for you. So you can see that with some tools and... Oh, man, this, there's a lot of gas in here. Some tools and a little bit of, a little bit of imagination. Con herramientas y un poco de imaginación, este, se pueden hacer las cosas. Y ustedes pueden comprar eso. You can, you can buy, you know... Stuff like that. So, on this thing, like I said, the header itself, the 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 initial header with this one, con esto, me costó, it was about $117 uh, from CIP. $117. Uh, uh, $20 for the clamps and $25 for the exhaust for the... And I think this this pipe right here is about $15. So 2020, 17, about 150, 160 dollars, and it sounds, it, it just sounds really good. It sounds really good. I like how it sounds. It's got plenty of room. You can probably do this on a in a and put it on a beetle, and it, it, it's gonna look good. All right, so I'll let you go. I'm talking too much, and I hope you like it. Uh, and yeah, you keep, you know, keep, keep getting dirty. Yeah, manténgase en, eh, ensuciándose porque aquí hay un montón, tú puedes hacer un montón de cosas, mucho trabajo. Nos vemos, se cuidan, hasta la próxima. Bye, chao.